Hello there and welcome. It's Ruth here at Artful Stampin and welcome to the Stampin Sunday Blog Hop. And um, this month we are going to be casing each other. So I've chosen a really lovely card by Barry from Mitosu Crafts. And uh, if I'm going to put the link in the description if you want to go and follow his instructions. So basically I've kind of like gone ahead and prepared a little bit before um, actually making the card so here I have the card base so just to kind of roughly explain but please do go ahead and watch how he does all the, the cutting out of this uh, you need to have a base that measures eight and one eighth eight inches and one eighth wide by five and a half inches and then what you do is you put your cardstock into the uh, trimmer and you score at four and one eighth then five and one eighth six and one eighth and seven and one eighth okay kind of easy so once you get you start off with the four and one eighth you just do it every inch and then barry goes and then gives you instructions as to how to kind of cut this uh section out in order to make a really cool kind of concertina thing so if you haven't guessed already i'm making this kind of pop out floaty um oh i don't even know what he calls it actually i need to go and yeah, what does he call it? A floating side panel fun fold card. There we go. I don't know if it has any other names, but uh, that's that's what Barry called it. All right, so I also went ahead and stamped. Oh, so I need to tell you what stamp sets I'm using, or stamp set rather. Uh, this landed on my desk uh, this last week, Thoughtful Expressions, and it's got some really beautiful images. And I made my own kind of like very simple DSP by stamping the large floral image uh, with petal pink ink onto petal pink card and just kind of like just stamped and stamped and, and made that so this measures uh four by five and three eighths then you need to cut yourself two pieces of uh, two rectangles this one measures three and one eighth by four and a half this one measures two and one eighth by three and a half and then you just cut out some matting layers uh, to match it uh, this one I actually cut um, a quarter of an inch less all the way around on this one so it's got a slightly wider border on that one uh, and this one's got a, a thinner border there we go all right but you can you, you do do whatever you want to do so these are going to get stuck on like this and I think I'll go ahead and stick that down actually because I've already pre-stamped and cut out a whole load of images here and uh, I'm going to just have lots of fun putting it all together so I think what I'll do is I'll go ahead and stick it down and you can listen to some lovely music until I'm done there we go
that was so much fun putting all those pieces together. Um, there are some really delightful little elements to that die set from the Thoughtful Expressions suite. And the um, hummingbird is so cute. And um, I hope you caught that. I, I, I deliberately cut two layers of the hummingbird and I... <laughs> Um, the, the, I, I, I chopped his beak off, but anyway, you don't get to see it because it's behind anyway. But I just think that adds a nice little kind of touch where you've got the two, the two lots of wings there. And yeah, just so pretty. Anyway, love it. So let me just go through the colours in case it's not kind of coming through properly. Um, so I use grey granite for my grey card base, then petal pink for the, uh, hand my own stamp dsp and then i stamped coastal cabana onto pool party and then just cut out a whole load of pieces i love 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 this lovely dotted texture around the edge of those dies they're so pretty um just oh, oh, just so delicate and gorgeous and uh, what did i use yeah so calypso coral as well just a really lovely delightful very calm kind of color scheme and uh, perfect for that those sentiments actually you're in my thoughts today which is I love that sentiment it could cover all bases you know um it could just be thinking of you it's like a, an alternative you know to I thought about you today you know no you're in my thoughts today how lovely and anyway my thoughts are with all of you watching. So thank you so much for joining me. Have a wonderful rest of the day. And please do go and check out the blog hop. Just link, click on the link in the description and go and see what else everyone has created. And I'll catch you all very, very soon. See you later. Bye.